In this video, I'll walk you through how I created this resume, which landed me five interviews and two offers in no time. We are going to design this resume from scratch. Let's open a blank Word document. The first thing you want to do is to set your format. So that enables you to stay consistent throughout. Step 1. Contact session. The contact session should be at the top of your resume and include your first and last name, address, email address, and phone number. Step 2. Professional Summary After your contact information, you may include a resume profile, objective, or summary. This is completely optional. Step 3. Education If you are a new college graduate like me or have minimal work experience, Prioritize your education. This session outlines your educational background and any academic achievements or awards you have received. Step 4. Experience this session highlights aspects of your past experiences which the prospective employer would value. Step 5. Technical Skills In this section of your resume, you can list your specific skills as they relate to the job you are seeking. We're going to insert table for this session. Click the Insert tab, click Table, and move the cursor over the grid until you highlight the number of columns and rows you want. Now that we have finished, let's save our resume to secure it. I normally like to save my resume as a PDF file because it will always appear the same on every device, no matter what software is used to view it. Click the File tab. Click Save As. Browse to the location you want to save your file. We're going to save it on a desktop. Give it a name. We're going to call it resume and a save as tab going to be PDF and click saved. And that's it. You did it. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, be sure to hit the like button and subscribe to my channel for more tutorials like this.